160 meters, ready to go and sent on their way. Fiery Pegasus just bobbled when the gate opened over there. Katiwa's Destiny shows pace, so to Ruler of Justice, Rodeo Drive, quickly off to the front on the stand side. Behind those take your place, a few lengths off them, Fiery Pegasus improved from a tardy beginning. Further back to Ethan's Butte is about five, six lengths off the leader. Silver Parasol is racing at the back end now as the head on down into the last 700 meters. It's Rodeo Drive, the leader towards the outside by a couple here from in second, Ketiwe's Destiny. Then in third position is Fiery Pegasus, got two and a half lengths to make up. Further back, take your place. Then came Silver Parasol, Ethan's Butte. Heading down to the 400 meter marker, Rodeo Drive by two and a bit lengths now from Fiery Pegasus in second, Ketiwe's Destiny. Take your place, starts to run on down the center of the track now as they enter the final 200. Rodeo Drive clear by two and a half lengths. Fiery Pegasus on the outside, then take your place, Rodeo Drive keeping rolling from Fiery Pegasus inside the closing stages. Rodeo Drive, Fiery Pegasus lunging late. Fiery Pegasus got up on the line to beat Rodeo Drive. Third placing, that'll go to take your place. Katiwi's destiny. Bella Boop Boop and Ethan's Butte. Let's have a look at the closing stages. Rodeo Drive had the lead on the outside of the course, clear by a couple. Behind that was Fiery Pegasus, who did not get the best of starts, but Pierre Stratum runs on when Cabello Mazzagnani starts hanging towards the centre on Rodeo Drive, and it's going to go the way of number three, Fiery Pegasus. Bred by the Greenacres Trust nominee, Mars Schertler from the Hemel and Stud. In Welcome back, here's Daniel. Well, fantastic. Congratulations, Daniel. 1,500 rand to come your way. Lovely win. Thanks so much. Thanks to Pierre Stratum for good ride. It's thanks to Edward Dufuke, it's thanks to all team, it's thanks to all sport betting, thanks to all owners, it's very, thanks very much. Thank you, Daniel. There's the 1500 Rand. Get the photo taken. Striker's going to join us now and tell us a little bit more about Fiery Pegasus. Anything at the gate? Yeah, she was. Firstly, I want to say well done to the starter for putting me in last. Because you could see on the way to the start, she was not uh, relaxed, she was a little bit above herself. and. Uh, uh, behind the pens as, as well, trying to keep her calm. Um, and luckily for me, they put her in last. Um, she still didn't jump well, and I thought that could be a, a, a race, but she managed to sit behind the, the leader. Um, wanted to go in, but I saw the leader was hanging in, so I thought, let me go to the outside if that hangs away from me, and uh, seemed to have paid off. Striker, yeah, I saw you were locked in at about the 400, but once you got out in the closing stages, run him down and get up to win. The horse that's got ability. Yeah, she was just relaxed, you know, and but like Joe was saying, she's ready to go much further. So uh, if she won now, then it's, a, it's, a, it's a, obviously something for the future. Well done to Joe, thank you for putting me on. Uh, obviously, I would have liked to have ridden the one in the first, but I'm, I'm uh, riding for a Sydney kid now, and uh, sometimes you've got to take the good with the bad. Oh, absolutely. And in the day during the dresser today, your best after this? No, I, I can run some places, but... Uh, I heard about the, the horse you're riding for Michael Azzi, Bob. Barberton, what? Sorry, I can't remember his full name. I've got no idea why everyone's talking about the horse. He's a very strong horse. He's a, um, he's a one-pace galloper. Um, hopefully I can lead and dictate and then maybe he stays on, but uh, you know, I'll be, I'll be very surprised if he does win, but obviously I'm hoping for a good run. Excellent striker. Thank you so much. I've heard striker say that a few times in our career, but uh, Joey, well done. Isn't it great to have it when a plan comes together? Yeah, that was... Uh... It's been a tough road eh? earlier in the season. We never had a winner for about five months. Uh, but we've been very patient with these babies. And uh, I'll just stand here and I'll get because I wanted to see how it felt to be a champion trainer, you know. <laughs> Pull your elbows up. <laughs> um, I just wanted to, yeah, so, you know, once again, like I said in the first race, thanks to everyone for being involved in this partnership. Uh, Jonathan from Betway, thank you very much and all the chaps, but most importantly, I'd just like to thank uh, Mr. and Mrs. Ngubi, yep. that's your first runner, uh, first horse they've owned, Lovely. and uh, they've had a second and a first. They're very excited, and I'm sure they'll soon be the face of horse racing in, uh, for four racing. I'm sure. A lovely couple. Mr. and Mrs. Ngubi, and this is a beautifully bred horse. No, very well. You know, the nice part is she's half-sister to Shango, who's looking for 10 furlongs, 12 furlongs. But in saying all that, I've thanked everyone else, Dalen, for the famous colours in the winner's enclosure again, him, Marlon and Savan. 
Gabby Neville, thank you very much. John, everyone, I can't go through it all again. Trevlin and Gavin yeah. Pillay. But just quickly, I've got to thank my staff, Edward and all the chaps there. And uh, uh, thanks very much for all your hard work, chaps. We're brothers, we stay brothers, and uh, we've got a lot of uh, lovely horses to come. Thank you, Joe. Well done. Well, Fantastic couple. Just quickly, well done to Muzi for riding this first time out. <laughs> Great ride, Peter Stradom, the old master. He is too good. Well done, Pierre. Well good. done. That's what it means when you put a team together that work together, things start happening. Mr. and Mrs. Ngube, Roger, come guys, congratulations. Nice to be in the winner's enclosure for the first time, I'm sure. And just tell us about the feeling when you see your horse crossing the winning post like that. Um, thanks a lot to Joe and the team, and I think uh, it's very exciting, the first win. My wife and I had to come and experience such a beautiful moment, and I think it's a memorable moment that one can never forget. Yeah, it's a great experience, isn't it? It is. The experience was epic. I mean, that's just how to sum it up. <laughs> you can't beat it when you watch that baby go past the post, especially when they win like that. And, and I think you're going to have a lot of fun in the future with Well Done. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks Thank you so much for being with us. Roger, just a quick word from you two. Come through. We'll get that. Uh, you've been in the game a long time, supporting everybody. Well done. Thank you very much. Thank you. And we've got to thank Joey. I mean, fantastic feat. Gabby for pulling me in, all the guys. And what another ride from Strike. I mean, that's why he's the master thing. But I want to thank everybody, all these new owners, Trev, the new guys, all the guys not here from Durban, all that. Sorry you couldn't all make it, but it's a fantastic feeling. But one last thing. Well done to you. It's so good to see you back. Lovely really to be back, so much. Thank you, Roger. Yeah, here's the photograph. Yes. yes. <laughs> Lucky green shirt. Correct. <laughs> Gabriel still superstitious with that green shirt, but there's the photo with an extra 100,000 rand to come to the winning syndicate. I don't know where Jonathan Bloomberg is. I don't know what happened to him. He was here earlier, and then he disappeared. He's gone to collect the cash, you 100%. Well done, guys. Thank you, thank you, Roger. Well done to our newcomers. Congrats so much. Well done. Thank you. I just want to say thank you to Uncle Joe and a brilliant run from Stryker. Absolutely. Well done. Thank you, Trev. Congrats, Trev. Thank you. Thank you, Clyde. Yeah, well done to Joe on a terrific double. Well done to the boys in dubs. And, yeah, we've got a lot of things to come with this horse, and we're taking it... Uh, in, onto a longer distance later on. Well, take it easy now for the rest of the day. The double land, you don't need anything else. Leave 100%. it. Confidence. Leave it now, Trevlin. Confidence was there. Thanks well to done. Joe. Yeah, Thank cheers. you so much. That's the latest from Turfentine. It's been a good one. There's lots of support, lots of happiness about as well. And hopefully the day continues accordingly.